Ooh, look at this fancy eggnog. Oh, it's a cocktail. Oh, I bet you this is so good. Oh, it's a wine cocktail? Should I try it? Yeah. You're telling me to try it, so girl, I'm gonna try it. It's cocktail time! Hello my friends, come and shop with me for my normal Costco grocery haul for the month of November. Now this is not going to be my Thanksgiving haul, even though Thanksgiving is coming right up, right? I'll be having to go back to Costco for that. We'll actually look to see if they have any turkeys and stuff like that when I go, but I'm not gonna buy that stuff yet. This is just gonna be my normal November Costco haul. I have my flyer here from, let's see, it's valid through November 21st. Usually they send a little book that has like the holiday savings and it starts now all the way through until Christmas each week different things that are gonna be on sale and they haven't sent that yet that's which is kind of odd maybe it'll come this week I don't know but let's like take a look at the flyer and see what they got it's a pretty good flyer this month they have these sweatshirts that are five dollars off they look like they're nice quality I'll look when I get into the store airborne four dollars off this heated throw for six dollars off electronics is always hot for Christmas like computers appliances you know any kind of device uh, TVs and stuff like that but we don't need any of that stuff let's keep going more electronics I ordered a new cordless vac nothing this expensive this LG one is really expensive I think it's like $3.99 or something like that um, but it's a hundred dollars off but I I'll share with you what I ordered in another video and let you know how I, I like it it's um I ordered it off of Amazon they also have the 32 degrees thermal tops and bottoms for kids and adults let's see oh sleepers for kids $10.99 two dollars off four dollars off excuse me like I said, the sweatshirts have a lot of men's sweatshirts here. Women's pajamas, of course, mattresses. We still love our Nova Form mattress that we got. Let's see, Ava's seven. So we got it when she was one, so six years ago. It's still, still rocking great. Some Shea Moisture shampoo and conditioner, Honest shampoo and conditioner, Neutrogena Rain Bath. Mm, this smells so good. Five dollars off. Here's where it starts getting juiced. They have the Oreos, two dollars and sixty cents off. The crackers, two ninety off. The Hellman's Manny's two dollars off. Crest three dollars off. Let's see the chicken stock. I don't like to get the chicken stock in the cans though. I prefer the container, like the jug container. I think it comes in a four pack. I bought some last time I was there. Just trying to pick up little things for Thanksgiving beforehand. I'm also going to pick up some butter. The Reynolds wrap. This is good deal. Four dollars and thirty cents off for the um, foil, heavy duty foil. I think that's the largest amount off I've ever seen, but sometimes they increase the price to make it look like you're getting more off, but really you're not because they increase the price, so I don't know. Tide, $5 off. I need to get some laundry detergent. I'm gonna try the Kirkland brand laundry detergent and see how I like that, um, how my family and I like that coming up. Oh, we don't use Tide or anything. I haven't used Tide in years, but they have it $5 off here. The bounce sheets, $2 off. I'm going to get some Cascade uh, for the dishwasher tablets. They're $4 off. Clorox, $3 off. Power wash, $2 off. Crescent rolls, $3.80 off. Now that's good. Something to pick up for the holidays now, and you can put that in your freezer. And then vitamins, of course. So, all right, let's head on to the store. Yay, it's not crowded. We have some batteries. Ooh, they're on sale for $15.99, double A 40 pack. We're trying to, my husband and I are trying to transition into um, rechargeable batteries, but I'm gonna text him and ask him if he wants me to get this, because that's a pretty good price. Then they have the triple A for $16.99. They have the Ninja Foodie. You all said so much about this that you love this. I believe this is the one you guys said, because this is a pressure cooker, it's an air fryer, it seams, it broils, it does everything. It's a crisper. And so a lot of you guys said that you loved your machine. Really nice. $149.99 is the price. Comes with a glass lid. Is it a slow cooker too? Hmm. I think so. For those looking for TVs, LG 65 inch, $569.99. This is the price until November 14th. That's a pretty good price for the 65 inch. 
75 inch, 1049.99. Honestly, TVs change so much. It's like, it's hard to know if you're getting a good TV or not. Honestly, they're, they're starting to change TVs like they've changed refrigerators, meaning they only last you maybe five years and then you gotta get a new one, which is kind of sad, you know, because it is a big investment, but they do have the TVs laid out here. Definitely do your research to make sure it has everything that you want in it. But this is Samsung 65 inch, 1199.99. See, what's the difference between this these 65 inches and that 65 inch, which that, it's like double the price. It's probably something special, probably 4K stuff. I don't know. My, this is my husband's area, not mine. <laughs> the 55 inch, 479. But you can definitely get a cheaper TV too. A cheap smart TV at that. This is the Kohler shower head that I saw. It's starting to get crowded now, just when I said, oh, it's not crowded up. <laughs> the Kohler shower head is 74.99. We have a GoPro. $339.99, GoPro Hero 9, Oral-B Smart Toothbrush, $69.99, not sure what this is. Oh, look at these. Now these should be on sale because it has Halloween. Oh, they have Christmas. Oh, they have Christmas. How cute is that? Anyway, they're $19.99 for a four pack. Oh, and they have Star Wars, Star Wars holidays. And here's the like um, Halloween. Oh, so cute. Really adorable. That's like a cute little gift. I have the ultimate faux throw. Faux fur throw. $16.99. It's nice for like your couch or whatever. Uh -huh. I used to get this all the time. You get two $50 gift cards for $79.99 if you have a lot of uh, people coming over for, how, for Thanksgiving. This is a good deal because you're getting $100 worth for $80. I never really film over here much when I do, but I, just to let you know, Costco has a lot of different TVs, lots of different options. They have like, what, four or five full rows, sorry, the, the music's so loud, of television. So when you're doing your research, if you're in the market for a television, definitely put Costco on your list if you're a member, because you can compare prices to Best Buy or any place else. Costco also sells Apple. Um, I don't know if it's like really that big of a price difference, but you know, maybe a little bit. Like look at this, $150 off of this MacBook Pro. So it's definitely something to look at. You have all the Christmas stuff, the wrapping paper, the, what? Why is the tape so expensive? Girl, $22.99, that's gonna be a no. That's really, ex I just bought this like a couple weeks ago for $8.99, this exact set. Now it's twelve forty nine. I hate that. These scissors, six ninety nine all year round. It's over in the office supply section. They're usually six ninety nine. Now they're nine ninety nine. I hate that. That really is unfortunate. You know. You got your lights. I always get inspired. I can't wait to get my Christmas stuff out. I love these Mickey bulbs. I think the, the, they're by Hallmark. Wow, twenty six ninety nine for a set of four. Woo. They're very pretty though. All right, I'm over here looking at the vacuums. I haven't looked at the vacuums in a long time, but I've been on this vacuum kick because, I don't know if any of you guys follow Go Clean Co. Go Clean Co on YouTube. She just did a whole series about cordless vacs. And my cordless vac that I've had for a long time, at least 10 years, well, yeah, 10 years, died. It does not work anymore. It was a cheap one I got off of Amazon. So I decided to get a bigger one and I just wanted to see what they had here as far as cordless vacs. Because I need it for the car. I need it to like vacuum our mattress. Sometimes upstairs in my bathroom it'd be easier if I had a cordless vac up there. So in my kitchen. Because my regular big vacuums just doesn't do it like a cordless vac on a hardwood floor to me personally. So I just want to see what they have here as far as their options. I love my Shark Zero M vacuum i've had for like two or three years now amazing vacuum i mean so good anyway they have this one but it's not cordless though it's just like a lightweight one 189 of course they have the dysons but to me the dysons aren't just they're just not worth the money in my opinion i like shark personally this one is the one that was in the flyer 100 dollars off but that's really expensive girl that, that vacuum better do a lot for that price plus it's cordless any cordless vac it's definitely not going to be as strong as a one that's cord like that has a cord with it now this is kind of cute 89.99 a shark wand vacuum now this is kind of i'm not gonna lie this is kind of cute i would love this for my car for the kitchen like this i mean we don't have any you know high chairs or anything anymore but just like little messes you can quickly empty it in the trash that's kind of 
That's kind of nice. I'm not gonna lie. $89.99. I wonder if that's a good price. I'll have to do more research on it. Look at this. Hmm. Hero Garden Indoor Garden. $20 off. Wow. That's kind of nice. Indoor garden for the winter time. And then they have, let's see, food saver, bag combo, rolls, and pre cuts. $10 off. $29. That was in the flyer. Can somebody leave a comment down below and let me know what this does? Anova. Perfect results every time. But what does it do? Precision cooker kit. It cooks your meat? It cooks? Okay. I guess it cooks your meat. I, in water? Oh. Huh. Leave a comment down below if you've ever heard of it or if you have one and it works. These are kind of cute. I think I saw these here last time. Now this is really cute. Love it. Feels so soft. They're $18.99 though. It's kind of high. I'd rather go to Walmart. Well actually, $18.99 it comes with two pieces. So they would be what? $9 each? Almost a little bit more. Huh. It's a good price. $9.99. I love this. It's so cute. They only have smalls left. Let me see. These are kind of cute. I wish the pants were like plain and didn't have that line down them. But they're on sale for $14.99. Those Mickey pieces are cute too. Let's see. I have Disney on the brain. Planning a big Disney trip for next year. And oh, oh, they're Harry Potter. There's the Mickey Mouse ones. $16.99. Cute. Zara would love this. It's like a robe almost. She always gets cold in the morning. She puts a robe on, but it's too small for her now, but she still squeezes in it. But there's something like this she would love. It's $19.99. These are cute. These robes. $14.99. Really nice plush robes by Carol Hochman. Look at these Disney robes or Disney fleece hoodies. I guess this is the adult version. They need to make it oversized though, not like form-fitting like this. Like one big size, $14.99 for these. These are really pretty pillows. I saw someone had in their cart, she had like six cream colored, like that light cream colored. Pretty fall pillows though, $14.99. Hotel Grand, softly around two pack standard queen pillow. <gasps> Y'all, I'm tempted, I'm tempted. You guys know, my OG subscribers, y'all know about the pillow dilemma with me. Oh my gosh, it feels good. Is it down? I don't like down though, because it smells. 100% US cotton, soft polyester iron, 500 count. That's a really good price though, $15.99. I don't like the way the down smells. You know, that's the only thing. Down smells really, really bad. Last time I, I bought a pillow, Girl, a down pillow. I don't know if you guys remember. My OG subscribers remember it. Flashback. So guys, I'm not even gonna go down the pillow aisle because for those of you who've been following me for a while, you know my dilemma with pillows. I did buy a pillow last month. It was like a down pillow. It was like 40 bucks for two. I get home with the pillow and I'm not kidding guys. It literally smelled like ducks. And of flashback. I let it air out and everything. I use it, but my nose is really sensitive and I could smell it all night, the feathers. Girl, don't you know I had a dream that I was getting chased. I was a duck being hunted by some hunters and I was getting chased and I never used a pillow again. <laughs> I've been looking for the best pillow for like six or seven years now, to be honest. How about these pans last year? I can't remember if I filmed it about it. I think I did, but I bought these pans last year and when I tell you these pans are amazing, amazing. I bought them because my main nonstick pan was starting to peel and when it does that, it's time to get rid of it. Really, it's not healthy at all, but this, these Henkel ultra durable non-stick pans are everything. So easy to clean. It, you could use metal utensils even though I don't. They're dishwasher safe. They're just really, it's granitanium non-stick coating. Anyway, I love them. They're $79.99. I think I bought them on sale $20 off last year for $59.99, but it was totally worth it. These, I need new mats, okay, for my kitchen. Because my mats are on their last leg, girl. But this would be nice in front of where I cook. And then also, I'm trying to think, where I do the dishes. It might be too long, though. 
for where I do the dishes, but it's on sale five dollars off. Hmm. I wonder if this could work because it's like a corner where I do the dishes and my dishwasher's right here and I do the dishes here and like I kind of prep my meat here so I need like it to be able to cover a wide area but I don't know if I should buy this or not. Should I? My last accent rugs I got for the kitchen were from here. They lasted a long time it's just you know now it's time they, they're on their last absolute last leg and oh they have cream that's pretty I'd like to get a new runner and how big are these let's see I like the style but I don't love the style you know what I mean so I don't want to feel like I need to buy it because it's on sale that's the problem I don't feel like oh it's on sale let me just buy it let me just wait it out and see they have the Cricut maker here $279.99. I have a Cricut Joy. I recently did a video about how I redid my pantry and I used my Cricut Joy. You can tell this out right here. I loved it. I love the Cricut Joy. I think there's so many things you could do with it, but if you're more advanced, you would definitely want to get a bigger machine like this. And you can do so many different things with the Cricut. Oh my gosh, this is perfect for my bathroom. A bath mat set. A bath mat runner. That's what we need. A bath mat runner. This color though. <sighs> I keep going back and forth about the color in my is this the only one that they have left? Looks like this is the only one they have left. Hmm. I need a runner though. Badly. Let me just not sporadically buy things. Just randomly. Without really thinking about it. Let's see. I need to get out of this section, girl. And focus. And get the food that I came here to get. This is where they used to have the toys. When they have rows and rows of toys. At least four or five rows. Of toys. Now, you're down to two. As it gets colder, the price of strawberries definitely go up. I just get upset if I buy these beautiful looking strawberries and I come home and like there's mold in the middle of it or something. Blueberries are cheap. They're only $3.49 so I wonder if it's because they're like molded. I don't know. They look so large. They had the wild caught sockeye salmon. This is previously frozen but they had the one that wasn't. It was so good y'all. I wish they had it again. Um, told me out of town. I can't remember but it was like two of these in one package and it was around this price so I don't know. Oh, so the price of everything is just going up. Oh these are chicken thighs. Let's see if they have any. Oh they do have the organic chicken tenders. So y'all how about I was at Kroger yes a couple of days ago. Don't you know girl the chicken wings guess how much the chicken wings were? Freaking $4.99 a pound for regular chicken wings. I couldn't believe it. I was like, oh my gosh, wings, my favorite, it's so expensive. All right, let me get some chicken. These, just for reference, these organic chicken tenders are $5.99 a pound. I don't understand why the wings are just a shortage. Why isn't the breast a shortage and thighs and everything else? It's one chicken, you know? I don't know why Kroger was shipping the Purdue chicken, which I love so much, was $4.99 a pound. Now these party wings are $3.99 a pound which is still pretty expensive because <laughs> these used to be like $1.99 a pound pre-COVID but it is what it is there's nothing really we can do I'm not gonna eat a pack though today because really it's just me Ava likes wings Sara she's some tiny about wings and Charles would prefer a chicken breast so I'm just gonna get the chicken breast yummy eggnog ah oh, this looks good it says 12 by 12 one though let's see yeah they're all 12 by 12 one does that mean it expires by 12 one? I wonder if this brand of eggnog is good. Not all eggnog is created equal. But I like the kind that I get from Kroger. I forget the brand, but it's really good. Here is the Tide and stuff on sale, $19.69. Clorox Colors is $9.99, $4 off. So, I've been using Ecos plant-based uh, laundry detergent for years, years. On sale, $11.29. I like it, I did, I do. I don't know. I feel like it's changed. It's not as good as it used to be, okay? I love the fact that it's made without formaldehyde and phthalates and all the other nasty stuff, right? But I think I wanna try this Kirkland brand, plant-based, safer choice. Why is it a safer choice though? Uh, I don't know, does this have formaldehyde in it? Oh, you get so nervous, it's like, oh, what am I doing? I'm gonna try this. If I don't like it, I can just bring it back. But I'm gonna try it. It's 
and we'll just see how it goes. I'm gonna go ahead and get some, oh wait, is this what I usually get? I thought I usually get the platinum. Cascade Complete. We usually get this, Cascade Platinum. Uh, uh, it's only, it's $4 off. Yeah, but the Cascade Platinum usually came in a container like this. Maybe they changed it? I don't know. Oh, no, that's it. It looks like this. But I don't understand what the difference is, but anyway. I'm gonna go ahead and get this because it's only $11.99 and we need some more. I don't need any Dawn Power Wash, but if you did need it, $7.99, it's amazing. Love Dawn Power Wash. So, let's discuss about this toilet paper. As you know, in the past I told you how they changed it. It used to be 425 sheets per roll, now it's 380, and it is a huge difference, huge difference. We run through toilet paper so much faster. It's really upsetting, um, they didn't change the price either. It's still $16.99. I can't remember, and someone leave a comment and correct me if I'm wrong, but I think it's always been $16.99. So, or maybe it was $14.99, I don't know, but I hate the change. The consistency is still the same, but I hate that we run through it so much faster. Y'all know I love these keto bars when I'm keto. Even when you're not keto, they're good, but. Here's the thing, my kids found these in the freezer and I was like, Mom, can I try your keto, your keto ice cream bars? And I was like, sure. Girl, why did they love them? Tore them up. They absolutely love these. These, that's how good they are. These were always $8.99 for the longest. And sometimes you can get them on sale for $2 off for $6.99. Now, $9.39. Well, the bacon is still up there, $22.79. Ugh, that's wild. This is the chicken stock that I like to get. The Kirkland brand organic chicken stock, love them. Resealable containers, you get six in a box for $10.79, but then they also have the Swanson chicken broth. Super cheap, $4.89 at $2 off. So let's see, and they have vegetable broth too. I have all the little Thanksgiving stuff over here. Oh, is that Lily's chocolate? You know, I loved these when uh, I was keto. So good. $11.99, you get a super big one. I like the dark dark chocolate. Then they have, um, you know, Kirkland's, some ice sweets, $7.99. Decorated milk, pure vanilla extract at $15.99. That's a really good price. At one point, this was $30 when there was a vanilla bean shortage. $15.99, this is pure vanilla too. Very good stuff. Ooh, look at this fancy eggnog. Oh, it's a cocktail. Oh, I bet you this is so good. Oh, it's a wine cocktail? Is it thick? Because you know, eggnog is thick. It doesn't look thick, but should I try it? Oh. You're telling me to try it, so girl, I'm gonna try it. All right, how pretty are these? Holiday hand soap, glass container. So pretty. They are $9.99. Never seen this Starbucks caramel macchiato creamer here, so I'm gonna go ahead and try this too. I need some more garlic powder. I love this garlic powder too, by the way. It's like my favorite. So flavorful. Seems like the containers are getting smaller though. A lot of ketchup, now I'm forced to buy this expensive behind ketchup. Well, not forced, that's a strong word. I can't go over to Sam's Club, I just don't have time. Sam's Club, I think it's $5.99 for the regular ketchup. But Costco stopped selling the regular ketchup and they only started selling the Simply Ketchup. I hope my family likes it. If they don't, I will be taking this back because for $9.49, it's just, I know it's supposed to be healthier for you, which is good. You know, no artificial sweeteners. I hope it tastes the same. I know, last time I talked about this, a lot of you guys said that your family liked it and they couldn't tell the difference, so I guess it's something healthier for us to do. I missed a good deal, y'all. They had these 12 cans, and I can't remember seeing this in the flyer, but between now and November 14th, they have the 12 cans of corn for $7.99, and they also had 12 cans of green beans for $7.99, but they don't have any more green beans, unfortunately. So I'm just gonna get the corn. Ritz crackers, $5.79. I don't buy this because the last time I bought this, they went stale by the time we eat them all, so. But if your family likes a lot of crackers, it's a really good price. All right, y'all, I'm back home. Let me show you what I got. Eggs, well, this is for my mom, actually. I'm gonna drop that them off to her. Some coconut oil, we use this for our hair and our body. Um, this is like a moisturizer for us, so we're low, so I got some more of that. Actually, the price of coconut oil has gone down because this used to be $14.99, but now it's like $11.75. We got some Hawaiian rolls, bread, bacon, sausage, butter, the garlic, granulated uh, garlic powder that I love so much, strawberries, blueberries. Y'all made me do it. 
eggnog wine cocktail. Can't wait to show my husband that. Avocado oil, organic chicken tenders, organic ground beef, the corn that I mentioned, that's such a good deal if you guys can catch that. I'm not sure if this video will be up before then. Some toilet paper, the ultra clean uh, Kirkland laundry detergent, lemonade, the Cascade dishwasher tabs, the Starbucks caramel macchiato coffee creamer, yum. The ketchup and yes, I believe, the, oh, also, it's a really cute sweatshirt. How cute is this, right? I showed you guys, it was $9.99. We'll try it, because you know, I'll take it back if it doesn't work. It's like a hoodie sweatshirt, super soft. Looks like this, nothing fancy. This is your basic sweatshirt. Altogether, I spent a grand total of $251.46. Again, the meats were really expensive. The laundry detergent, the toilet paper, I mean, everything's so expensive now. And it's kind of disappointing that there really wasn't any toys, hardly, um, at Costco either. But that is it, my friends. Leave a comment down below and let me know. What would you get from Costco? Have you done your Thanksgiving shopping yet? If you celebrate Thanksgiving, if that's something that you celebrate. Have you started getting your uh, Thanksgiving groceries? Because I feel like I need to hurry up and do that because that's going to be uh, smart scarce too because they said that the tur there's a turkey shortage. So I don't know. At this point, you won't know until you go into the grocery store. But anyway, thank you guys so much for watching. Make sure to give this video a thumbs up if you like this type of content. And I will see you guys in the next video. Bye.